Olympus is a leading manufacturer of professional opto digital products for consumer, medical, and life science markets. And as we continue chatting with as many of the exhibitors here at the Showstoppers press event, this is an event that's taking place before the actual IFA. Uh, fairgrounds, if you will, open officially to the public and the rest of uh, the folks in the industry. It's a time when several of us media folks can get together with a lot of the folks, do a little FaceTime, see some products, see some new things that they're going to be showing here at IFA. Well, Olympus, of course, among them. The Corporate Communications and Marketing Director is Heino Hilbig. Heino, welcome into tomorrow. How are you? I'm pretty fine. Glad to have you with us. I love a guest that brings products for show and tell, and you've done just that. You have a lot of very cool things to show us. So first of all, what new products is Olympus introducing here at IFA in Berlin? Yeah, I mean, it sounds a bit strange, but at the IFA, we bring mainly a, a good number of good new products on the uh, camera field. Cool. Um, it's a, it's an, it's an uh, uh, audio uh, show here, but cameras are represented as well and we have a couple of new cameras such like the new line which we have here ah well tell us about that particularly new line and and what this is some neat looking things with some great uh, colors as, as well yet yeah, what you have in your hands is, is actually my most beloved stuff because we have them in colors which are so unique and if you have if you hold them um, you will definitely be uh, de uh, the, the, these cameras will be desired to have from from people looking at you. I like the black one actually here, which I have. It, it looks for me like a piano. Uh, it does. It, it does look like a very nice piano finish. Of course, the one I'm holding here, and, and for the, all of all of our listeners that may be driving right now, don't worry. We have video podcasts <laughs> available for all of our guests at the at the IFA broadcast. But this one is the IFA Red, if you will. I'm I'm going to. Hold it up to the Dave cam, and as soon as uh, Andres, uh, oh, that is the live one. Yeah, okay, I'm looking at the wrong monitor. But you see, it's, this is kind of IFA red. So this is appropriate for this week. Everything is red, Miss IFA, red hair, red dress. <laughs> I like that very much, actually. I, w I, I was using a different name for that, but I, I, I would change to IFA. I, yeah. I used a sports car, you know, the very, very, very top one. Yes. Um, I don't name the name You don't name them? No, 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 because you have several. And you don't <laughs> <laughs> but at least for this week, we're going to say it's the IFA it's, it's Red. It's definitely the IFA Red. From, I will change the name. From Olympus. Now, for such a tiny camera to be 10 megapixels, for example, that's pretty awesome. It's it's not only 10 megapixels. Everything which you want to have from a camera like that with an image stabilized. It has all this face detection stuff. It has a lot of uh, ready-made features and sets which, you, which make it very simple to take good images. Yeah, terrific. And, of course, face recognition, we, I think we're beginning to take that for granted. We're expecting Absolutely. cameras to have Absolutely. that. Absolutely. Without that one, it's a camera nowadays is not a good camera anymore. That's true. Yeah. Now, and it's doing a pretty darn good job. I know with the Olympus line, that we do use some Olympus cameras as well and have been very, very happy with them. But it's important to have something like face recognition and let that pre-focus help you and, yeah, and pick up on all the faces. Yeah. Yes. All, like night scenes and all this kind of stuff. Have you ever been done good images and, and film times and night scenes? I have never done it. Oh. So here it's very easy. That's but I like I, I like actually to show you this one. Okay. A again, unfortunately, we are on the radio here, but um, that's something I I find rather cool. It's a, it's a product called uh, uh, Mu 1050 SW. I think it's in the states it's called uh, Stylus. Oh um, yes. And it's it's a product which is um, from the series which can be taken underwater three meters can be dropped one and a half meter, no problem. Don't f but the cool stuff, the real cool stuff is that. Um, you can operate that one without touching the buttons. For example, if you're snowing, uh, if, you, if you go uh, skiing, if you go to snowboarding and this uh -huh. kind of stuff, you simply touch it here, you have the function, move really? it. That's yeah. terrific. Okay, now see, we can show this on the on the camera during the interview. So you've got to come by the website graveline.com, intotomorrow.com, and see the kinds of things that Hino is talking about here. And this is amazing. So you just tap the side of the camera, and you're going through all the different functions. Absolutely. This, yeah. So the end, it's it's the end of fumbling around to find that shutter button on the camera. Just yeah, tap it, and there it is. Go, flash on, have flash to off, push fill it. Yeah. Well, yes, but, but you don't have to be going through all these menu if, concerns. If you're, so. if, if, if you're really, I mean, just think about it. You're, you're going uh, uh, skiing, and what do you have? You have big gloves because yes. it's so cold outside. Yes. So uh, <laughs> what you do, take off all, when you take a photo, you want to take off the gloves and freeze, freeze, and, you know, you don't do that. You simply tap. 
That's uh, what we call tap control. Tap control. That's that's excellent. Now, is this is obviously some unique technology now Absolutely, uh, that, yeah. that Olympus is working on to do some pretty cool things. And just tapping it, even if you don't have gloves on, you're fumbling with it anyway. Just Absolutely, tap the darn thing and yeah. get go through all the the menu functions. Um, and you mentioned uh, uh, shock proof to some degree, waterproof or water resistant no, no, uh, to some level as you well. Can, you can take images underwater. And what I like even more is for families. I mean. When I take images of, uh, took images of my daughter when she was going swimming, what I had was I, I took the images from the, from the side of the pool, always top down. Yeah. And, and children <laughs> never look good taking images top down. They look always small. Yes. But if you, with this camera, you go in, in the pool, you swim with your child, and you take images on the same level and gives you totally different pictures from your children. What a good, what a good idea. And yeah. It's a whole different set of fun things to show family Absolutely. as well. Yeah. Uh, look what you missed at the beach, the pool, whatever the case might be. Take it on your next cruise because it'll be safe. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> So. Whatever happens, I mean, you, you will definitely be, a, be sure it works. Now, you're also showing some cool audio products. Yeah. And, and Olympus, of course, been known for doing some neat audio recorders as well, but not something you think about when you think of a, of a camera company all the time no. is some, some unique audio uh, no. products. Tell us about it. Yeah, we are a producing company. We produce something. We produce images. We produce audio. Um, we don't just replay that. Um, what we have here is... Um, uh, the latest generation, we call it a PCM recorder. I actually love more the word of it's an MP3 recorder. I mean, we uh. all know MP3 players, but how do you record something you want to replay? And that's, um, that's something which is, we call it the smallest studio. It's a studio, a real recording studio in the, in the palm. Um, and we actually prove it in our booths. When uh, on our booths we do have a small telephone cell. Unfortunately, I have to say it's a British one, not an American one. <laughs> um, and we do we do put two musicians in this small cell, um, and they will do a record over there, a live record, and you will hear it. It's it's like like it's it's a CC, it's a CD. So you're saying like a telephone cell, a telephone booth, as yeah. we would refer to yeah. it uh, back in the states. So yeah. and and they're producing uh, an album. In the telephone Absolutely. booth. That's what they do. With Every one of these Olympus devices. Yes. So. The LS10 uh -huh. is, is the only and the ultimate uh, recording tool for everyone who wants to have it on the palm of the hand and very, very cheap. I mean, it's, it's less than 500 bucks. Wow. And I've, I'm sure you hear it all the time. It looks a little like uh, Mickey Mouse because <laughs> of the windscreens. But what's great about this device is it has windscreens. Absolutely. So you can record in, in nearly any environment and yeah. you're going to get good quality MP3 recordings. Absolutely. That's wow. what it does. Take advantage of all the cool things that Olympus has to offer as well. Visit them at Olympus.com and olympus Europa. Dot com for the kinds of things that uh, Hino and his team are working on. Certainly check them out, and we thank you for spending a few minutes here with us uh, at, during it was Berlin. Great Ifa. to talk to you. Glad to have you. I have to catch up with you because there's so many more things to talk about. This Absolutely. at least gets us started. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Hino Hilbig, the Corporate Communications and Marketing Director for Olympus. We're back with more from Berlin, Germany, and lots more coverage of IFA. It's the International Funk Ausstellung. Funk is radio. Ah, so right away, we pay attention. Ausstellung is uh, electronics. So it's all about consumer electronics. Great stuff. Some new things this year, too, at IFA about white goods, appliances. We'll talk more about that, too. <laughs>